that sang a song of long ago when things were green and moving slow and people stopped to say hello but they'd say hi in 1974, I moved to Dayton with my parents. We had lived there before, but uh, this would be for a much longer period. And this enabled me, now about 12 years old, to explore more grown-up pursuits like photography, which I studied that summer at the Dayton Art Institute. I immediately became aware of downtown Dayton as it was a photographer's first destination. It became apparent to me very quickly that downtown Dayton was changing innately I knew that I needed to start photographing the landscape as blocks began disappearing, flattening out, growing up. I was lucky to have first a Leica, then the camera with which I did most of my work, a Roliflex lent by my dad. I moved away from the area permanently in the early 80s and left my photographic negatives at home. In 2009, after the death of my father, I found a neatly packed box containing virtually every negative I'd ever shot. I bought a decent scanner and took the box back to New York, where I slowly gave new life to the now decades-old images. These are the pictures which infuse this project, the Dayton poster. My hope is to share a bit of my excitement over the city as it was in the 70s to those who may remember it and to those who have never quite seen it this way. The poster is meant to represent something beautiful, but also act as a personal statement of affection and imagination, looking back to a lost decade, to a lost generation, and to life itself.